name is Annie Toll. Welcome to God in Scripture. Today we actually celebrate a very little known feast day of Saint Wolfstone, who is a Benedictine English saint from the Hereford area. I only know this because I happened to be listening to the Walsingham Mass this morning and the homily was about this saint and I've never heard of him before. So um, he lived in the 11th century and was known very much for helping the poor and also for helping to abolish the slave trade from Bristol to Ireland at that time. And uh, if you remember, St. Patrick was also a victim of the slave trade in the 4th and 5th century. So that had been going on a long time. So that is a major achievement. He also realised that a lot of his diocese couldn't get to Mass and he knew how very important the sacrifice of the Mass was. And so he was instrumental in rebuilding um, two cathedrals and also Tewkesbury Abbey and he built the beautiful St. Malvern Priory of which there's a picture here. He's also known as the Saint of Vegetarians uh, as he loved his food and one day he really wanted a goose, he fancied a goose so he asked his cook to cook a goose and as he was saying Mass that day the odours, the smells of this cooking roasting goose came into where he was saying mass so his thoughts started to go on the lovely meal he was going to have later and imagined eating this goose and then he suddenly realised where his thoughts were going during saying the mass and he was absolutely disgusted with his lack of piety so he um, vowed he would never eat meat again and he didn't, he didn't even eat the goose that was roasting so that is a lesson in great piety for ourselves. So also at Mass this morning, um, we were asked to pray for uh, the choosing of a new bishop for East Anglia as Bishop Alan Hopes, the, bishop, the current bishop, is retiring. And he actually confirmed two of my children before he moved to East Anglia. So he was a lovely bishop. I was very fond of him. And um, so he's retiring and we, we need to pray for the church to choose a new bishop. So we are St. Wolfstone today on his feast day and of course Our Lady of Walsingham to intercede for uh, the church to choose the new bishop. So I'll just pray the Lady of Walsingham prayer if you would like to join in with me. O oh, Blessed Virgin Mary, Mother of God and our most gentle Queen and Mother, Look down in mercy upon England thy dowry, and upon us all who greatly hope and trust in thee. By thee it was that Jesus, our Saviour, and our hope was given unto the world, and he has given thee to us that we might hope still more. Plead for us thy children whom thou didst receive and accept at the foot of the cross, O sorrowful mother. Intercede for our separated brethren, that with us in the one true fold they may be united to the Supreme Shepherd, the Vicar of thy Son. Pray for us all, dear Mother, that by faith fruitful in good works we may all deserve to see and praise God together with thee in our heavenly home. Amen. St. Wolfstone, pray for us. Our Lady of Walsingham, pray for us. Thank you for listening. And um, if you've liked this video, please share it. And if you're not subscribed, please subscribe. And hit the bell button to be notified of any new videos as they come out. Thank you for listening and God bless you all.